hear me out this way. Beat the beat the arts, nigga. Yeah. Beat the arts. Beat the beat the arts, nigga. Arts. Beat the arts. Uh, beat the beat the arts, nigga. Arts. Raw. This is the story of a young nigga chasing his dreams, battling under odds to make how hard it seems. Go ain't with a trap, so I'm ice beating the beast. My bait supreme, gotta look nice when I'm seen. Worry your mindset, watch how this little nigga flex. Nothing but sticky stones, look at how dangerous he gets. Knocking on the door of any giant that wanna battle, not a cage. I'm out of limits, small woman wanna rattle. Put the greatest flame against my shot of candle, but I slow your sound, chop it down like my samples. Lyrically sung pro tools, it's a war like I'm Sun Tzu, kicking Liverpool, come through lyrically. I sung Goku, fucking your biggest weight, couldn't outmatch my heart. Destiny of a way, odds, smothering all the odds. You call yourself a titan, but you never seen a braver nigga. Ages just bitter, what's a Goliath to a David nigga? Already, man, this is lunch break session. Uh, let the people know who we got here today. Yo, what's good? It's your boy Raw Elements, representing Forever Fly, outside in Dallas, Texas. Your name is Raw Elements, man. That has a meaning behind it, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Raw is an acronym for, for rhythm and writing. So it's raw, rhythm and writing, and then the elements. So it's like raw, rhythm and writing, or the elements of rap and hip hop. So like, my name is like the elements of rap and hip hop, basically. All the essentials. So where do you originate from? Uh, Baltimore, Maryland. West Side, Baltimore, Maryland. You been in Dallas for, how long you been in Dallas, man? Uh, 13 years. 13 years. For 12 years. Yeah, 12, 13 years. So, how long you, how long you been rapping? Long so, been? Like, probably like 10, I was like 10 years old. I started off writing poetry. Then I kind of got into rap battles. I used to like look, look at the rap battles online all the time. Um, then that transcended into rapping when I moved to Texas at like 14. Yeah. Can you remember the first thing you ever spit or the first thing you ever wrote? Yeah, that shit was trash. <laughs> really trash. What are some of your inspirations, man? Where do you get your inspiration from? I mean, nowadays, it's different. Like, the, the world inspires me now. Uh, when I was younger, I used to just go online and listen to all my, you know, the legends, the rap and the hip hop and all. And I, I wish I still do, but now it's, it's, it's more like um, life experiences. That's usually what kind of turns my creativity on, gives it that spark. Um, when I travel, when I go out of town, it's really inspiring. When I, um, when I see a good movie, Anything creative um, in terms of film or, or writing, that usually kind of sparks my creativity. Well, to me, like when I hear you, it sounds like you got an East Coast flavor with a down South feel, man. I really, I really like your sound. Yeah, I like that, man. Yeah, that's dope. I, it definitely, it definitely originates from like a, a, a East Coast kind of flow. I'm from Baltimore, so from Baltimore. But yeah, man, I'm down here, and anything around me just influences me. So I always kind of try to. Sprinkle. I know I got a lot of hype and shit. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's that's from my down south influence. But I always try to incorporate my uh my lyricism in there. You know, I always gotta keep my shit intricate, you know what I'm saying? Uh, forever fly, man. That's, that's one of the biggest clothing lines in the city right now, man. I see hey, you always spreading man. always spreading the, the love, man. Got the you got the summit on camera, man. You got the drop on. Yeah, man. I've been out to a couple of your events, man. I see you hold an open mic every last Thursday of the month, man. How's that been going for you? Yeah, man, it's been going really dope. Um, this is going to be like the seventh one. But yeah, I just decided to, back when I, whenever I first came on the hip-hop scene, there was this open mic called the Arnetti. And that's basically where everybody in the city got their stripes and kind of got their names, where everybody kind of first started. Like, from all the biggest down names, like, in the hip hop world, and that, that was my first uh, time performing. So yeah, it was really tight. We basically went out there every weekend uh, or every month, and it was hundreds of people. We met, we all just rocked it out. And it was the thing to do, and it's we don't have that no more. So I wanted to like kind of rekindle my own version. We're doing really good. We got Miller as the one of the special guests. Uh, uh, thir- uh, next Thursday or June 29th. That's gonna be tight. We had, uh, we had my homie um, uh, Alfred Banks come 
all the way out here from New Orleans to perform. We had someone from DC flying to town just to come on the mics, and I was really tight. And it's really getting traction like that. So yeah, here is this lounge. Last Thursday of the month, Dallas, come through. Hey, what do you have coming up, man? What is Raw Elements like? Have his future goals? What does he got going? Uh, well, I got to EP about to drop. Um, hopefully in July, if not August, I'm shooting for July. Drop both at the same time. Um, then I'm working on an album as well. But right now, I'm trying to get the EP finished. Um, working on a tour as well. Going on tour pretty soon. And um, it's really it. And basically just trying to tour nationally. You know, we're over there in Europe, over here in the States. Yeah. Um, and then really getting the Feather Flower brand bigger than me to where it's basically like the supreme debate. So you plan on it being a household name? You plan on that oh, yeah, being most, for real? Most, most definitely. Yeah. If you don't like me, you don't fuck with my music. You fuck with the brand and wear the shirts, it's all love. Wear that shit. Yeah. You know, Feather Fly is a lifestyle, it's a mentality. I, I literally like dedicated my life to music what I do, and I, I want to encourage everybody to, to do that, whether, whatever you do, whether it's photography, videography, music, dancing, becoming a doctor, a lawyer, football player, basketball, get in there, put your 10 hours plus in, 10,000 hours plus in, and, uh, you know, really, really ground for it, you know what I'm saying, so if I'm a fly, when you wear that across your chest, when you wear that, that means you from a fly, you're reaching your goals, and that's, that's a lifestyle. Right now, how do you feel the Dallas music scene is? Um, it's uh, it's good musically. It's, it's good creatively. It's always been good musically, good creatively. We have all types of dope sounds. We got, we got trap. We got the hood shit. We got the we got new soul artists out here. We got all types of stuff out here. Besides the politics side, the music side is good. So I'm Come up. Shoot, man. I appreciate you, man. This is Lunch Break Session, man. Tell the people where they can find you at. Hey, man. Y'all can find me at uh, Raw Elements with a Z on Twitter and Instagram. And you can find my music, Raw Elements, on Spotify, Apple Music, Tidal, Amazon, Google Play, SoundCloud, YouTube, all that. Oh, and, and uh, the clothing line in music. They lying to me, they lying to you, they lying to them, they hiding the truth, police executing niggas with no noose, I found the real pictures, I'm exposing the proof, this the part of the story, I tell you how I feel, now this ain't the movie, nah nigga, this the real, Every day I'm working hard for the dollar bill, thinking to myself, really does skills still appeal, green paper control the masses, then they laughing, Better go to school, nigga, better catch your classes Gotta get a degree, or nigga, you won't survive And stuck paying debt by slaving your nine to five What, what, but that's not for everyone Fair chance in this world, well, that's not for everyone Fair try on court, well, that's not for everyone Forced under my control, nigga, that's everyone Programs since the day a nigga started walking Hundred spells ever since a nigga started talking The world wanna hate me cause I'm tripping holy melanin Watch the holy figure so they appear to be better than Stole the grounds that we were forced to hurry then settled in Niggas that we made it cause we have a black president Nah, nah nigga that's progress But if you knew what I do, do you be beyond a protest? Yes, you would be beyond a protest Trying to figure out what they're hiding behind the fog next Be careful what you read, nigga gotta be conscious Am I being too humble if I'm being too conscious? My relations strong like Martin and Gina I leave you Hiroshima with these bars in my katina I go to amongst the sheep, you see it on my demeanor I'm hot with the bars, make you do the Macarena Trying to dwell more into the conscience of my Bible People bowing down, worshiping all these false idols But I'm too focused on all these models and bottles Plus a nigga getting lost from the rewriting of a Bible Uh I gotta be a prodigy, exploited our culture and music and made it a mockery Define Israelite from the book of Deuteronomy Did you miss a couple things in the book, nigga? Probably Yeah, why do you think they still hunting us? Uh, why do you think they still shooting us? Uh, mentally raping us And some of us just waking up Uh, the whole nation cursed And it only gets worse, niggas can't learn the truth So niggas read and catch the scoop, then we doomed But I'm done preaching had to just talk to you niggas I hope I spark some deep thought in you niggas Until I drop part two up on you niggas What? Raw elements, fellow fly, Dallas, Texas, Baltimore, we for what? Hey, nigga, I'm coming for the throne, won't be no denying 
fuck it, I might go and start a riot. I wouldn't know the ass that made a nigga try it. Look what happened to the liar. I'm coming for the soul, you know the night. Fuck it, I might go and start a riot. I wouldn't know the ass that made a nigga try it. Oh, look what happened to the liar. David took a liar. Man, it gets giant.